with your weatherbug.com severe weather outlook. I'm meteorologist Gretchen Mischik talking about some very hot air that will be impacting portions of the upper Midwest along with the potential for flooding in the southwest. The Twin Cities will be under an excessive heat warning that goes into effect tomorrow. We're looking at a potential high temperature in the upper 90s. Heat indices will be over 100 degrees. Sun has already been shining this morning. Today it's cool compared to what's coming. The Twin Cities uh, within that pink shaded area that's where the warning will be in effect tomorrow but all of the orange shaded areas indicate the heat advisory that stretches from North Dakota already back down to Wisconsin in terms of stronger storms we could see uh, thunderstorm activity this afternoon right along the international border the yellow shaded area indicates where we could see uh, areas of uh, thunderstorms this afternoon capable of producing hail gusty winds uh, northern portions of North Dakota, including Bismarck, Grand Forks, and Minot included within that zone of concern this afternoon. Let's head down to the southwest where we're keeping an eye on what is Tropical Storm Ivo. This storm system still spinning to the southwest of Cabo San Lucas, but it is uh, potentially heading northward here, heading into the next couple days. It will likely lose its tropical storm status before it encounters the Continental 48, but nonetheless, there are concerns for flooding in areas of the desert south West. It's difficult for water to absorb into the land here, so it doesn't take a whole lot of water for flash flooding to occur. So from today through Monday, it's possible that uh, tropical rainfall could lead to flooding concerns in an area stretching from Utah all the way down into Southern California, Las Vegas, Flagstaff, Blythe, all included within that zone of concern. So we'll continue to keep an eye on it right here. Check back to Weatherbug for your latest severe weather update.